once I, you know, until I have somebody else to just make me feel that, I'll probably be maybe fixated. But I, I've reduced the energy to more so of like a, a cordial, cool energy. Yeah. As opposed to like, when I wrote Fire Sign, I was in love. What was the sign? Aries. Hey, shout out to my boy. You were Aries. <laughs> <laughs> But no, I guess that I was just going to ask you to explain the song. You just kind of did. Yeah, Fire Sign was that song that uh, he kind of told me we didn't make sense at the time. And in my mind, I'm like, he's so full of shit. Why? why? Because give me a yes or a no. Don't give me a maybe. Don't give me a now it's not the right time. Because I don't respect that response, truthfully. You know, it doesn't change how I view him as a person, but I don't respect the way that he went about it. So that's why, like, breaking down everything and realizing how he treated the situation is the reason why I could be cordial, you know, but the feelings ain't the same. Because a realer nigga would have went about it a realer way. You wouldn't have told me, oh... We don't, you know, it doesn't make sense right now. It would have been like, either you do this and we do that, or, I, you know, it ain't it, it, ain't it for me. You say a lot without saying a lot. <laughs> you know, it ain't it for me, you know? Yeah. I would have respected it more if he was like, you know what, you're not what I see in a wife, or you're not what I see in a girlfriend, as opposed to, not right now. I don't like that. So that's why when I wrote the song, I say you're full of shit. I think you're full of shit. And I sent him the song. <laughs> he, he turned it. He know. He said he know. Yeah. I'm not going to hide it. But I was so, like, immersed in something I wasn't ready for. I didn't want a relationship after my last serious relationship. Like, <clears throat> I was single for five, six years. I had to, uh, I had to face a lot. I had to go through a lot. And when I got out of that is when I really met that guy. So it was coming into it like, this is not what I want, you know. And I knew I didn't want that for years. And then it was like, one day the shit just hit me like a ton of bricks. Like, damn, he's great. <laughs> <laughs> he's amazing. <laughs> what am I doing? Like, what? And I was moving too. So it was just like, I had moved to Atlanta. I wrote the song before I moved to Atlanta though. But I moved to Atlanta. Or did I, Tim? Did I move to Atlanta before I wrote, wrote Fire Song? We were at Fire Song. I was in Atlanta with you when you did that. See, well, I had just moved to Atlanta. And I feel like that distance is what did it for me. It was like getting away and realizing, damn, you know, I would have done this with you. I would have, I could have waited, but I didn't want to. I didn't, I didn't want to. Yeah, Fire Video, by the way, Fire Video. Shout out to Timothy yeah, yeah. on the production, the video, the everything. Me and Timothy Probably make... Probably took him two hours to do it all. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Timothy, he, he has great turnaround time, good business. That's my favorite hidden gem from the city. 